Hi, Tyler Bankin, your friendly garden guy. Today, I'm gonna to show you how you can make a classy DIY gift that retails for $50 for under $25 in under 10 minutes. This is one of my top favorites, something I take to a housewarming party, birthday, any plant lover. This is super easy maintenance, not intimidating, and really, really quick to make. Okay, so one of the first things I do whenever I start this project is I look at my container. So I've chosen to work with this larger globe today. You can get this at your craft shop, home improvement store, local plant nursery. This is basically a globe terrarium. It's a very common thing that you'll find a lot of different places. After you know your container size, then you can look at your other materials. So for example, for this larger one, I'm gonna choose maybe like a more medium size air plant. And for this smaller one, maybe I can make this smaller air plant work. After you kind of have those things chosen, you can work on your base. So this air plant is going to be the feature of your gift. So everything else is going to kind of be the bedding, be the surrounding around that air plant. What I choose to do is use some preserved moss. So this really brings some green in. Preserved moss was once living. So that means now it's not living. It's, it's died now to keep these colors, but that means it's zero maintenance. So it's gonna bring the green in and we create a really soft bed under the airplane arrangement. I've also chosen some pebbles. They're a different texture. You're gonna be a mixed range of colors. It also kind of helps to hold the moss in place down at the bottom. But whenever you get your rocks, whether they're from your garden or they are from a home improvement store, chances are you're gonna get them out of the bag and they're gonna be a little bit dirty. So I think it's a really good idea to wash them out, either in your sink or in your hose. And it really brings out the different colors in the rocks too. You can use these as your accent. You can also kind of go outside the box and get something, let's say maybe it's an ocean lover or a beach goer. You can incorporate shells or sticks. I like to incorporate the hook on top and use my twine here. There's so many different things you can add to it as well. First things first, grab your container and you're going to put the moss in. So we're gonna start at the bottom and work our way up. So the moss is our base. We're gonna lay that in and then we're gonna do some pebbles. I like to do the big pebbles first these kind of help create a different texture, but they also really help to hold the moss in place. After we add those, then we're gonna add the smaller texture pebbles, the pea gravel to kind of fill in the, the, um, the spots in between the rocks. Next thing we'll do is just pop in our air plant. You'll wanna be sure whenever you're popping in your air plant that it's positioned in the way that you want it. So the good side towards the opening of the glass globe. Once you put that in, you can add your accents, whether that's your shells or your sticks or anything else that you have around the house that you think could pop in there. So whenever you're adding your twine to your globe, to the little nook here in the top, you wanna be sure that whenever you knot it, to maybe double knot it, it's out of security, but it should hang. This is a fairly light arrangement, so it's not like it's too much weight at all. Also, whenever you're doing your twine, if you're giving this as a gift and you're not sure if they're gonna hang it or maybe they're gonna set it down next to their bookshelf or something, I usually cut it about two feet long. It's a good kind of um, medium distance to, to cut it. All right, so the best thing about this gift is whoever gets it, it's such easy maintenance. All you have to do is take the air plant out every seven to 10 days, soak it in water for 15 minutes, let it dry out upside down for 15 minutes, and then pop it back in. That's it. I'm your friendly garden guy, Tyler Bankin. Thanks so much for watching. Everything's available on the website, so go check out the links below.